V is for vegetable oil. Sounds healthy, right? Vegetable oil is a processed oil and the process that they use to extract the oil is a chemical solvent and that's about all the information that we have. We don't actually know what these vegetables are, what they do to them or the quality of them. Some other oil options that you might find like these could be bad for your health because of their high content of omega-6s. We want to avoid cooking with these, but we also want to notice when they're an ingredient in a food that we're buying. Even if you buy roasted and salted nuts, you don't actually know what kind of oil they used. You want to buy them dry roasted or raw. So what should we use? My go-to oil is always going to be olive oil. I love coconut oil and avocado oil for high heat, but olive oil also is its own beast. We have to find oil that follows all these different parameters to make sure it's actually good olive oil. Consider yourself lucky if you're in a country that just has great oil. What are we looking for? We want extra virgin olive oil. We want it to be organic and in a glass bottle, particularly a dark bottle, so a lot of light can't get through, which can actually make it rancid. Unrefined and cold pressed. Not all oils will have this, but the harvest date is actually more important than the use by date. Buy an oil at the store, now you wanna see if it's good. Here's a test. Take your olive oil, pour a little bit of the oil into the cap and take it back like a shot. You should, first of all, taste a black peppery kind of taste in the back of your throat and you should cough three times if it's a really good oil. Please comment your favorites.